Hi, I'm JS Cornoyer, and welcome to Entrepreneurs at a Crossroads, a series that gives you an inside look at those crucial moments when a small business comes to a fork in the road and its leaders need to make an important decision. Today, we're in my hometown of Montreal to meet with Joe Poulain of Luxury Retreats, a company that creates custom luxury travel experiences. Let's go check it out. Hey, Joe. Hey, Jess. How you how doing? How you doing? Good, Good to see you. you. Yeah, thanks for coming. Yeah, I'm glad to be here. Why don't you tell us a bit about what Luxury Retreats is? It's a company, I mean, I founded back in, in 99, but today it's grown into, we're the largest brand in the world for luxury vacation rentals. We're over 50 destinations today. Uh, with 2,000 plus homes. So these are not places that you can get for 100 bucks a night, I assume. So right? you're close. Uh, yeah. I mean, there is a wide range of them. It's 300 to 50,000. So there's, there's, there's a, there's a 50, wide... 50,000 yeah. so a day? A day, yeah, exactly. Wow. Luxury Retreats is a company that helps travelers rent first-class accommodations from owners of luxury homes. It's fitting, then, that Joe Poulain launched his business inside someone else's home, his parents. That's where he started building commercial websites when he was only 15. I got a, a call from, from someone who had a villa in Barbados wanted me to build their website. Mm -hmm. And said, sure, great, never traveled before. And I don't know why even to this day, I hopped on a plane and then I flew down to Barbados. Went back home anyway, uh, back to Montreal, built the site anyhow. That job led Joe to create a bigger travel site with the business model that distinguishes his company from its competitors. Instead of simply putting travelers in touch with people who want to rent their homes, Luxury Retreats is directly responsible for everything from screening the accommodations to booking the room. You're going to go online and you go on a home away, there's 700,000 listings. You click on Italy, there's 12,000 of them. Sure. How do I find the, that one that fits me? We, you know, we do that part. We might only have 100 in that location, but they're the 100 that we've gone and seen. But Joe decided to take this idea one step further. And there's a lot of other uh, operations that are out there where they rent you the villa, you show up somewhere and they hand you the keys, right. and then, then you have your own experience. Not luxury retreats. Joe understood that his clients wanted more than just a place to stay. What the traveler experienced after the booking was paramount to their travel experience. So just under two years in, the company came to its crossroads. Joe realized his agents couldn't be focused on sales and personal services all at once. So he built a separate team fully dedicated to a customizable concierge service. So this is our concierge area over here. So again, private chef. Uh, yep. Food provisioning, very popular with our guests, whether it's car rentals, so some of the easier stuff to more elaborate things. I mean, if you really yeah. want a private fire So food provisioning like is the, someone goes to the groceries and fills up the fridge? Absolutely, much. exactly. So everything you need to custom in advance, whether it's the type of beer you want, low fat yogurt, you know, whatever it is, then they can go ahead and arrange all that stuff. Luxury Retreats is now the largest full service villa renting company in the world. And that's meant that they've been able to upgrade their own accommodations. So how many people do you have here? I think we have about 105 right now wow. out of this office over here in Montreal. That's a lot. We've got about another three offices around the world. So combined full-time staff, about 150 today. That's more than double the staff that Luxury Retreats employed four years ago. And that's an impressive rate of growth. Not bad for a company that was started by an inexperienced teenager. For Entrepreneurs at a Crossroads, I'm J.S. Cornoyer. See you next time.